Rapid development of industry in Britain, England in the late 18th and 19th centuries brought about the introduction of machinery. The role of women came into play. Factories opened work opportunities for women outside of their home. They worked quickly and productively, but were paid less than or half of what men received. Children worked too, as young as six years old, and worked hard long hours for little or no pay. Many accidents occurred, injuring or killing children on the job. Women and children faced many hardships as a result of their poor working conditions and were put into unhealthy jobs such as the mining industry because they were the cheapest source of labor. Women also faced the double burden of factory work followed by domestic chores and child care. Families became dependent on the wages of women and children as a result of the growing cash economy. On March 25, 1911, a fire broke out at the Triangle Waste Company in New York City, killing 146 workers, mostly of young immigrant women and teenage girls who were burned alive or forced to jump to their deaths to escape an inferno that consumed the factory in 18 minutes. But until new laws were formed, did things improve for women and children?